continuing to try new things with the Centauri Carbon from Elegoo that we just got off of pre-order. Here's the first model that we have printed that hasn't come out really nice. And I say that, like, look up here. The saucer section of the NX-1 really looks good. As you move back to the aft section, you know, a little bit of cleanup that needs to happen from breaking the tree, tree supports off. But, oh, okay, so we have a nacelle failure. Uh, I'm going to blame this on a breech warp core, but uh, in actuality, I think what happened was the tree supports... I printed this vertically, and the tree supports holding up each of these uh, vertical nacelle pieces. Let's see if we can get it to focus again. Those tree supports uh, broke loose a little bit up where they contact the nacelles and uh, let them kind of wobble around, and you can see where it... Uh, Really messed up the printing until it was able to recover. This one uh, that's closest to the camera here, I actually used a little bit of tape uh, that you see stuck to the side here. I wrapped that around the tree supports and the nacelle to stabilize them, and it recovered fairly quickly. Not, not beautifully, but quickly. The other side, I didn't even see when that one broke loose, so... Uh, that got a little wonky, but it didn't ruin the print, and the rest of it actually turned out stunning. So I think I went with minimalist tree supports uh, for the way I had it arranged. I think that was a mistake on my part. I need more robust tree supports when I'm going to do something tall and skinny like that. But the overall print quality, uh, you know, I really enjoyed the prints out, out of the Elegu Neptune for max uh, but they just weren't this good a detail